welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new video today i'm doing a misguided haul i haven't well it feels like i haven't done a haul in a long time it's only been probably about a month maybe but just quickly if you are new here it would mean the whole world to me if you could go down there and click subscribe if you're not already so for today's video i'm doing a little loungewear haul i'm kind of bored of everything that i've got in my wardrobe right now because I just wear the same clothes all the time, especially during lockdown. I wear the same joggers, the same baggy t-shirts, and I just, I just wanted something new. So the other day I hopped onto Misguided and I picked up, I think three or four outfits. But I did do outfits this time rather than just like random pieces. Hopefully this gives you a little bit of inspo for your lockdown outfits if you are looking for some. But I will say a lot of stuff is sold out. Everyone is in the same boat wanting new loungewear, new comfy clothes. So a lot of it is sold out, but I will link everything down below if it is still in stock. And it is going to be a try and haul as always. And I'm just going to mention quickly, I am hosting a giveaway on my Instagram right now. If you want to enter, it will be here. Check out the post on my feed to have a look at the description to see how you can enter, all the rules and all things like that. But yeah, that closes on the 15th of May. So make sure you're quick. You don't want to miss out. But yeah, I'm going to get into it. So if you do enjoy the video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Let's get into it. So I've got a little bag full of goodies. I've got three of these, so you've got £25 off when you spend 60 or £40 off when you spend 100 And they've given me three! <sighs> Great. This is not good for my bank account. I thought it was having buying clothes under control and now it's all out the window. <laughs> Prices will be left on screen as well because we Scotty don't put them on the receipt. It's a little bit annoying, but yeah, I'm going to get into it. I'm excited. Outfit number one, we've got a little bit of beige. I don't know how well this is going to go with my hair now that it's pink. But we will soon see. Okay, so outfit number one. First up, I picked up a pair of cycling shorts. These are just a sand cycling short. I did get them from the tall section because I'm pretty sure that's all they had left. And I also got them in a size 12 because that is all they had left. Like I said, everything is sold out. But even though everything's sold out, I still picked them up because, you know, they're cycling shorts. They're not, it doesn't matter too much. And to go with them, I've got something that's big and baggy, so... It doesn't really matter if they're a little bit bigger around the waist, if you get what I mean. As long as they're comfy, that is all we care about. So they're just literally plain sand cycling shorts. So to go with the cycling shorts, I picked up this jumper. And this is the Misguided and Tiger King collection. I loved Tiger King. So when I saw this, I was like, thank you very much. So I did get this in a large and it literally looks the perfect size. So this is the jumper I picked up to go with the cycling shorts. It is the same colour. I just thought nude on nude is always such a vibe. So it's just this sand colour and then it's got two tigers on the front and it just says misguided in white writing. I got this in a large like I said because I just wanted to go for that big baggy cosy oversized feel with the cycling shorts. I think that would be such a nice chilled outfit. So it's exactly what I wanted. It's big, it's baggy, it's oversized. It's this beautiful sand colour and even though it's got two tigers on the front like you don't even have to like tiger king to like this i just think this is such a cool jumper it's got nice big sleeves which are cuffed on the ends but yeah i just thought this outfit whether you're in lockdown or not is just gonna look unreal kind of need the pink to wash out my hair because i don't think that's a vibe what do you think but this isn't permanent anyway so i can't wait to wear this i think this would look really nice with a pair of white chunky trainers something like that but yeah that is the first outfit okay so outfit number two isn't normally something that i would wear it's a little bit more girly and colorful like i've come all about my color recently so this is perfect i can't wait to wear this so i'll show you the top first so it's a little cowboard and it's in this unreal lilac color again pink hair don't think it's a vibe i kind of look like a seven year old so it's just like a little high neck cropped jumper. I really like the sleeves on this. It's kind of a similar fit to this t-shirt. As you can see, the sleeves are quite short and quite tight, which is what I really like about this. And the material, it's like a knitted cotton material. And it's got this like line down the front of it. Then on the side of it, it's got a tie, so you can tie it together, cinch yourself in, and that would look really cute. I just don't own anything like this in my wardrobe first of all the colour is beautiful and you don't have to just wear this with the matching bottoms you can wear this with jeans you could wear this with joggers anything so i picked that up in a 10 love that so much can't wait to wear that i'm gonna get so much wear out of this and then the little trousers this is what makes it not a bit of me like not even not a bit of me because i do love it it's not normally something i would go for sorry i keep playing with my hair these front bits are really annoying me so to go with it is a pair of cotton wide leg trousers 
These are so cute and so girly. I don't wear wide leg trousers ever. Size 12. Surely I picked those up in the wrong size. I don't know what made me think a size 12 would be okay. I'm a little bit confused. I picked these up in a size 12. I'm guessing that's all I had left, but I don't know why I would have ordered them if they only had a size 12 left. We'll try them on anyway. They don't actually look too big. Ooh. So the waistband... But for a 12, that looks quite small. So hopefully they'll fit. I'll be really happy if they do fit. So they're really high-waisted, as you can see. And then they're the exact same material and colour as the top. With just a wide leg trouser. And then they kind of flare out a little bit at the bottom. I don't know about anyone else, but these kind of trousers remind me of Groovy Chick. Especially because they're purple as well. Just ultimate Groovy Chick vibes. But this could be worn, again, in or out of lockdown. But I just think on a day where you're feeling a little bit... Mm, Throwing on something like this but still being cosy but being cute just gives you like a little bit of a of a little boost when you're feeling a bit rubbish. So I can't wait to wear that. That is beautiful. Kind of gutted that I got them in a 12 but yeah they don't seem like they're going to be huge. So pray for me. Let's hope that they fit because I love, 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 love this set. Oh I already know I'm going to love these. Yes, 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 yes. So outfit number three and four. Are kind of the same like I've got a pair of joggers but I've got two separate tops to go with the joggers but wait until you see the joggers wait until you see the joggers I am obsessed already so as you all know tie-dye is a new trend at the minute also want to do a tie-dye video let me know if you want to see that I will tie-dye some of my clothes but these joggers I love them so this is the joggers these are gorgeous. So these are black and they've got kind of like grey tie-dye all over them. And then they're cuffed at the bottom. They've got an elasticated waistband and also some drawstrings so you can really pull yourself in. These are the tie-dye 90s joggers. I picked them up in a size 8 because the 90s joggers are always oversized. I'm misguided so definitely stick to your size. I just fell in love with the tie-dye. I'm really on the tie-dye hype at the minute. I've owned nothing tie-dye but... The rainbow tie-dye, the pink tie-dye, the black and grey tie-dye. I literally love it all. This is my first piece of tie-dye clothing, boys and girls. And I love it. These are unreal. Love. Okay, so to go with these joggers, I'll show you the two tops. So the first one is just a bodysuit. So the first bodysuit is just a little basic that you just need in your wardrobe. And it's this black kind of scoop neck bodysuit. And it just says misguided on the front like that. But I really like the back of this. So it's quite a... Not open back, but okay, you can't really tell. The back comes down to here. <laughs> Trying to show you on black. Isn't... Oh, there you go. So it is a really low back, and I just really like that. But obviously, you probably wouldn't wear a bra with this because you'd be able to see it at the back. And also, it is a thong bodysuit, and it does it with the little clippers at the bottom. But yeah, not really much to say about it. But I just think this with these joggers. It's just, again, a comfy but cute outfit. Love those. Pick that up in a size 8. It does look quite big for an eight, but it is from the tall section. Because your galley's five foot seven, so I'm tall. So love that. Very happy with that. I think I've just found my new favourite outfit, boys and girls. Can't wait to get this one on the gram. So because the joggers have a grey in them, I picked up this little halter neck. I was going to say sports bra, but it's definitely not a sports bra. It's like a crop top. This is going to be kind of hard to hold. And show it just looks like this there we go so it's just this gray cotton material halter neck top i just thought this is so cute like it's comfy it kind of just looked like a sports bra when you put it like that so on the days where you're just chilling you're not really going anywhere this would be perfect you don't need to wear a bra with it i picked it up in a size 10 i feel like i probably should have got an 8 but we'll try it on and see but it's just this charcoal gray color which matches the gray on the joggers which is why i picked it up and then on the side it's the same as Guy did. And it's got like a thick elasticated band to go kind of there. So that is going to be really cute. Oh my god, I love that. They had this in so many different colours as well. I will link this one down below if it's in stock. But they did have loads of other colours. So if this one isn't in stock, I will link another colour. But yeah, that is so cute. And I just think this is again a chill outfit. I just love it oh my god i'm obsessed with everything in this haul so that is it i know it wasn't a big haul but i just wanted to get a few not essentials because these aren't essentials but i just wanted a few new bits to spice up my lockdown wardrobe i'm sick of wearing the same bits and i didn't want to spend loads like i didn't want to be 
extreme with it so i just picked up a few bits to keep me going throughout lockdown because god knows when it's gonna end but yeah i hope you are staying safe and everybody's okay but i'm gonna end this video here everything will be linked in the description make sure you let me know what was your favorite piece from the haul personally these joggers take it for me definitely i am obsessed with these but i'm gonna leave this one here so if you did enjoy the video please don't forget to give it a big massive thumbs up it helps me out so much don't forget to subscribe if you are new here but yeah Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.